Okay. B'shem Hashem Nasev Nasiach, tonight is 24th of Av, Tav Shin Pe Gimel Haba Alanun Etobah. Be'ezat Hashem, next week this time it's going to be Rosh Chodesh Ah, Rosh Chodesh Elul, Anin Erodili, Vedodili, so we are approaching Rosh Hashanah very fast. So we want to prepare Be'ezat Hashem for Rosh Hashanah. And Dabar Beito Ma Tov. So that's a good time to learn about the mitzvah of Teshuvah. So Zohar HaGadosh, uh, in Parashat Le'e, uh, sorry, the Chok Yisrael of Parashat Le'e brings uh, a lot of places from Zohar HaGadosh that talks about Teshuvah dependence. So one of the... One of the Zohar HaKadosh of Chok Israel of Parashat Le'el, Leon Shedishi, talks about Teshuvah that is originally is brought from Parashat Mishpatim. So Zohar HaKadosh goes on to say, come and see, talk as they, right? That the Pasuk says, Vayelech Shobab Vedelech Libo. That the person who is Shobab, that he is in a Farsi, they call it Shaitun. Right, that he goes, you know, he does all sorts of uh, things, you know, that are not appropriate, you know, goes after his Sahara. He goes after the desires of his heart, as the Pasuk says. Uchti Barthay and Nedran says, Delachav Raiti, Bepaehu, Banahu, Bashalem, Nechumimlo, Babala. That Akadosh Baruchu wants to do him a favor, right? So it explains that HaKadosh Baruch Hu wants to do him a favor in order that he would do Teshuvah. Right now he's going after his Ta'avot Halev, he's going after his desires. But HaKadosh Baruch Hu is of Harachamim and wants to do a favor. So what would HaKadosh Baruch Hu do to such a person? Right? So HaKadosh Baruch Hu waits for him. Right, pre, or even would have the hamim for him that he, he should come back and leave all that uh, all his chataav. Vayelech shovav. What is the explanation of vayelech shovav? Afal gav the chayavim avdin kol ma avdinin bezadon. Even though that he did all sorts of mistakes intentionally, right? Nevertheless, says Zohar HaKadosh that Hashem wants him to do Teshuvah. And Hashem would give him opportunities to do Teshuvah. Da'aznin ve'archei de'lavu That HaKadosh Baruch Hu wants him. That he comes back to his... Uh, uh, and correct his shelirot, uh, all his shelirot libam. All his uh, mistakes of uh, all his uh, wickedness of his heart. And there is all sorts of warnings for him that he would leave all his wrong ways. But nevertheless, he doesn't want to listen. Right? Uh, as, uh, as we see, e- almost every day a person has uh, thoughts of kharata. He's sorry about his mistakes. According to some, even if a person has hirhure teshuvah, even if he has the thoughts of repentance, Agadosh Baruch accepts even the thoughts of uh, repentance. So great, you know, this opportunity of teshuvah that we have. Right? So Zohar HaGadosh is telling us, no, much more than that. Even if a person does things in, a, in intentional ways against Hashem, still HaGadosh Baruch Hu awaits for his Teshuvah. Beshata detanin bitibuta benatnin orcha taba detibuta When a person comes back to do Teshuvah, to, to, to the good ways, uh, uh, of uh, making Teshuvah Ha Asfate Zimna Bechablehu Immediately HaKadosh Baruch Hu accepts his Teshuvah And not only that 
Akadosh Baruch Hu cures his, uh, his, his mistakes, right? Shagadosh Baruch Hu sholeach lahem sadirim leor otam derech and not only that, HaKadosh Baruch Hu sends him messengers, Sadiqim. We're talking about the Russia. HaKadosh Baruch Hu would send a Sadiq for this person to teach him how to do Teshuvah. This is how much HaKadosh Baruch Hu desires every Yehudi to come back to him. As the word of Teshuvah, the Shorish is from, the, uh, from Shuv, the ten, right? That every Yehudi has Selem Elohim, that every Yehudi uh, comes for his uh, main part of Neshama from HaKadosh Baruch Hu in a spiritual aspect, and therefore Hashem wants him to come back. Right? So why does it say Choser B'Tshuva? Why, why, why do you need the Choser? The Tshuva means turn. Ah, uh, very good. So uh, first time I heard it from Rabbi Pesach Kron Shalita. Mm. That our Pesach Quran explained what is the meaning of Baal Teshuvah. Baal Teshuvah really could also mean he has the answer. <laughs> and he has the answer. And there was, he didn't know certain things. Or for, certain, for whatever reason, he didn't, want, he didn't want to understand what is the truth. So you come back. Baal Teshuvah means now you have the answer. Now you have no more doubt that Hashem is your, your father, right? So going back to your question, which your question is? Choser. Choser. What is Choser? You come back to that which you originally had, mm. right? If you never had something, how can you be, how can you do Chazara? Chazara means you go back to it, right? Choser, you go back to it. So originally all of us, all, all the Neshamot were, were Tahor. Right, as we say in Elokai Neshama, mm. we say that HaKadosh Baruch Hu, the Neshama that you gave to us was Tahor. And not only that, HaKadosh Baruch Hu cleans the Neshama every day. When a person goes to sleep, HaKadosh Baruch Hu gives him another chance by cleaning the Neshama. Mm. So, going back, we go back. We go back to Hashem. Hashda eat there is Takela. So if we come back and if we come and we look at the Pasuk, I al Khaya Amar Kera or Al Matya Amar Kera, what is this Pasuk talking about? Is it talking about those who are living or those who are dead? That Hagodosh Bahu wants them to do Teshuva, that Hagodosh Bahu wants them to return. What are we talking about? That really you can see you can really understand the Pasuk exactly. What is this talking about? Is this talking about somebody who made a chet and, and got punished and is dead now? Or no, still he's alive. Right? He, still there is opportunity for him to return to come back. Right? So Zohar Agadosh goes on to explain that that the Shobab that goes after his heart right? uh, begin the Yeser Hara the bed takid kibon shah Yeser Hara Shavu Chazak. That why this Yesahara that we have is a, a very old being. Right? In fact, Yesahara goes back to 5783 years ago. When the Adam was created, we did it in another Zohar. Zohar Akadush explains, I think we did it last week or two weeks ago. That when HaKadosh Baruch Hu created Adam and Chava, right? Then uh, Chava uh, uh, was so perfect, and Adam Arishon as well, that all the Malachim, they started becoming jealous. Mm. That was because and Hashem was teaching them Torah that they were jealous. Yes, yeah. teaching Torah. So they got jealous of the Torah, mm. and then the, 
the the female aspect of Samech Men, right, came down from a place called Chalon to Gan uh, Eden, where the Adam and Chava were, and then made made it to a form of a Nachash, a snake, and uh, and did whatever now uh, whatever the Torah says that tricked Chava. What was this all for? Uh, jealousy. Uh, so we see from the very beginning that this Malach of Hashem works very hard. And the Malach of Hashem knows exactly how we operate. Mm. So, so Zohar Avodosh tells us Hashem is helping us. Hashem knows, as it says in Masech Perachot, that HaKadosh Baruch Hu knows our inner feelings, and later on, Agadosh Baruch is going to take away our, uh, our lev and change it, right? And right now, our lev is a lev uh, even, right? Is that what the Gemara says? Hashem is going to replace that to lev basar? Is that that? Yeah, so lev basar. Right? So Agadosh Baruch is going to shech that man of Hashem. Ama Gucha Baruch Hu, Ana Istericha, Lachtefa Didei. So Agadosh Baruch Hu says, that I come, I come to help you. I'm going to help you to uh, the right way, Tebe, to the right way. Chadahu Dikhti, as it says, Lerachav Ra'iti, Dera Aznin Bechashucha. So Agadosh Baruch Hu is saying, look, I've seen what you're doing. You're going in a dark way. I understand you. I'm going to help you. Agadosh Baruch Hu, in a way, he comes. And he uh, uh, shines the light to us. He shows us what is the right way. So my soul, as Dwarah well, Kodesh tells us, at the age of 13, Hashem gives to Bar Mitzvah two Malachim. These two Malachim will protect him, mm-hmm. will help him to go in the Orech Yashar, in the, base, in the correct ways, Derech Yashar. Right? As if Keman the Aklif Bida Bida the Akhara Bakike Migo Khashucha like somebody who comes holds your hand right to uh, to take you from a dark place to where the uh, the light is. Bashalem Nihumim Lo Ure Avala Uba Ala Avalab. Right, so that ha it it has the mercer ivu umitaves. So now over here is talking about somebody who is already dead. Iva dai metab ihu vechayim bechayim ken hu shenigramet aval kishu adain chayim. So what is this? A person who does chataim, he's like a dead person. Mm-hmm. As the Gemara says that the shayim, the metim. That the wicked people, even when they are alive, they are, they are like dead, they are moving mm-hmm. dead body. Right? And mm-hmm. the mitatam, chayim. That even the righteous people, when they, they pass on to the next world, they are still alive. So, because he's wicked, he's like a dead person. And HaKadosh Baruch Hu comes, and HaKadosh Baruch Hu comes, and HaKadosh Baruch Hu does chesed with everyone. Uh, in a way, our Shabbat comes eulogize this uh, this person who did Chataim, mm-hmm. and he's like a dead person, right? And all the surrounding people who were influenced by him, our Shabbat comes and helps them to do Teshuvah, right? Ela Kuchaberuchu does the good to them. Kevan the Ale Mishadosh Esrei Shenin the Ala. This is now the Zara Kadosh. Pakit Imei Teren Mal Achin. Neturin, that at the age of 13, 
Hashem appoints two angels, right, to every uh, uh, boy to protect them. The Nathale Chad Minei the Chad One of them will be on the right side and the other one on the left side. Kad Azil Barnash Beorach Meshar when a person goes in the right way, inun chadayin be veistakifu imei bechedva. Then uh, these both two manachim they both become happy, right? And they rejoice, right? And they get extra power. These manachim they they become, right? Uh, they get sustenance out of uh, its food. و مخرزان غمی و امرین ها بو یه قر دیوغ نه ده ملکه and they become powerful right and they announce تنو کبود لیمدوت همیلخ شیش تو سیل ملوکیم به زخورت معصا قطوبیم so they say look this, uh, this being here is a سیل ملوکیم and he, he did right things. Mm -hmm. So let us praise him. And they come, they praise him, they protect him. But when this individual does Avera, what happens? When he does Avera, Inun mit Avelan Alei. They sit Shiva for him. These two Malachim. Mm -hmm. uh, they, they, as if they they go and they mourn over him. Why? Because now this uh, uh, this individual is going to be punished. Umit Abberal Minei. And at that time, Umis Talegid Mimenu Beena Melavin Oto. These two Malachim, they sit Shiva for him. And they don't, they don't accompany him anymore. He's too malachim. When he does a khid. Kivan da akdif be kucha beruchu ban higle be orach meshar. When Akadosh Baruch comes and takes his hand at that time, Hashem comes himself. And Hashem comes to rescue him. Hashem, as if to say, takes the hand of this person to show him the right way. Kedin Ketiv, as it says in the Pasuk, Vashalem Nichumim Lo Ule Avalab. Vashalem Nichumim Lo Vekat Meta. That Hagodosh Pahu does in the beginning to him. He pays him the Inu, the Hanem Almad Avar Vekat Meta. Shenit Harret Alma. So Agarosh Baruch Hu helps him to become, to have charata, right? to come and have remorse and be sorry about his mistakes. Right? And then he would accept sakhar. Right? Right? And that which uh, he's doing now, now that he did Teshuvah. So who helped him? HaGadosh Baruch comes and helps him. As we said previously, Hashem sends him wake-up calls. Hashem sends him Sadiqim. Mm -hmm. Hashem sends him Malachim, right? To, uh, to protect him. But when they, he does Avera, then he doesn't have the protection, right? Other, uh, uh, other wake-up calls and other uh, individuals come to help him. Now, one time, Arab Yezeh ben David Oliver Shalom said something very interesting. Harab ben David Oliver Shalom said that what is this whole game, soccer? That everyone loves to watch soccer. Mm -hmm. right? In United States, it's not that much. They like, they like the American football. Right? The soccer, they don't. What is this? So Harab ben David Oliver Shalom, the Darfa, she explained. Because the soccer is all about the Jewish life. It's about our life. How? 
It says in the Torah, right, Parashat Bereshit, right, in the, uh, in the Parashat Bereshit, of Seder Bereshit, that HaKadosh Baruch Hu took uh, uh, dirt and uh, made it in the, into the shape of Adam, and then Hashem blurred Neshama into it, right? That, re that compares to a ball, right? Yeah. Ball, in the older days, Right? You also had to, you know, mm -hmm. put uh, some of uh, your own, uh, uh, you know, air into it. And then, what is this ball? Everyone is fighting over this ball that is compared to Neshama. Right? Mm -hmm. You have 11 people on this team mm -hmm. and 11 over there. Right? And at, 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 at any time, there is only one person who has the ball. Mm -hmm. Right? That one ball is the person himself. The ball is his neshama, right? That uh, you have ten people mm -hmm. in your team, they help you, mm -hmm. right? They could be your parents, they could be your friends, they could be your mentors, right? They could be your rabbanim, right? Uh, your neighbors, right? your sefarim, mm -hmm. you, you know? You have ten people beside yourself in your team helping you. Mm -hmm. And on the other side, you have eleven people, right? Could be also some Sahara, Achila, Shetia, right, uh, Arayot, right, uh, uh, laziness, whatever you name it, right, and they all fighting over this neshama, right. They want to take the neshama to the uh, to to the other side, right, mm -hmm. and then there is this person the that uh, oversees the whole process, right? Mm -hmm. and, and he comes and he gives, you know, uh, yellow, red, whatever, right? Mm -hmm. That could be a rob, that would be at certain times, HaKadosh Baruch himself mm -hmm. giving the wake-up calls. Mm -hmm. So this is all about that. This is all about the process. We need to do Teshuvah. We need to do Teshuvah. And it says over here, that a person should know that uh, really when a person does the shuba, comes back to Hashem, he is alive for sure. Right? sitrin. Right? From all the sides you look at him when he does the shuba, he's alive. Right? and he is Touching himself to Etzchaim. As it says, Etzchaim he lemachazirim ba. And in the, in the, in the Olam Asud, there is a place, it's called Etzchaim. Right? That from there, a lot of uh, uh, Shefa of Beracha, Hastacha, and all sorts of protection and Torah comes. Etzchaim refers to Torah, Teshuvah, Bekiva, and the Achi, Veilane, Bechaye, when we Right. grab onto this tree of life, then we consider a bad Teshuvah. Right? Because we accepted the Teshuvah. The Ha'a Knesset Israel Teshuvah of Ha'chi Ikrei. Right? That at that point, right, this Midat Manchut, that is called Knesset Israel, right, uh, also Nikra'et Gam Beshem Teshuvah. The, another name that refers to Knesset Israel is Teshuvah. Did you know that? Hmm. Teshuvah in Shaman. Ve'yuhu ba Teshuvah ikhrei. Umidat ha-yesod shemashfiyah la nikhra ba Teshuvah. And there is a midat yesod that comes and, and helps a person to make Teshuvah. That midat, that hmm. spiritual power is called Bal Teshuvah Ba'adda Afilu Sadiqim Gemurim Eina Yecholim La'amod B'magom Sheba'alei Teshuvah Omidim So this is exactly what Gemara says also Zohar HaGadosh and Gemara they agree that the, the place where the level of spirituality that the person who made Teshuvah even though that he was uh, not a Sadiq Gamur, uh, the, the level of Baal Teshuvah is greater than a person who was born in a, a religious family, 
who, who grew up religious, he kept all the misfort, everything. Right? But the person who made a mistake and he corrected his deeds, he made Teshuvah Shalema coming back to Hashem, his devil is, is, is much greater to Hashem. Uh, there are different reasons why we're going to speak to that, speak about that later. Baruch Adonai Leonam. Amen. 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 So if you could press that button.